Once, long, long ago, in fact centuries back, lived a lad named Diogenes, mostly called Jack, who lived in a nut in the midst of a forest with his teddy bear Fred and a barmaid named Doris. They were ill-used to comfort and ill-used to wealth. And Doris was ill-used by the Baron as well. He was flabby and fat. He had pimples and scurf. But he were a Baron, and she just a serf, just a slave to the system, a slave to the system. Now Doris were portly, that is, built like a door, with two great big knockers that knocked and she swore, I wish that bloody Baron Sir Fitz would drop dead, cause he stinks and he won't take his spurs off in bed. And each time I kiss him it fair makes me wince, in case he goes pop and turns into a prince. But what can we do, die? The Baron's the state. And we're not even socio-economic group eight, we're just slaves to the system. Slaves to the system. Then all of a sudden a great airy-eared, oily-skinned fairy called Father appeared. I'm a-selling protection, thousand lira per year, protection from barons and droit de seigneur. We are skint, Doris murmured, but take off your shoes, and I'll make you an offer you couldn't refuse, and I'll pay you in kind or in droit de seigneur, cause that's almost Italian for screwing the workers, the slaves to the system, slaves to the system. Next morning, the fairy godfather were gone, but in the yard a great beanstalk towered up to the sun, and the sign said, No barons, this beanstalk's patrolled by man-eating giants, and so is the gold. Now the baron were greedy. His mammonary gland were the principal organ that guided his hand. What's this rubbish, he cried, have the deeds to this earth, and deeds speak louder than words, don't they, surf? You just slaves to the system, slaves to the system. So climbed the baron all proud and defiant, till he found himself up face to face with the giant. I'm Sir Fitz. Said the Baron, Giant said, By gum, or as Grandad would say, Fee for five bloody fum. I'm so fit, said the Baron, and I come for me gold. Burger off, said the Giant, it's all state controlled. I'm the state, said the Baron. Giant, be a good chap, and don't give me none of that aristocrat, you're just a slave to the system. A slave to the system. I'm no slave, said the Baron, I'm a Tory by birth, and I reckon I've just about had a surfeit of surf, and that goes for giants too, now what do you say, will you give me the gold? The giant said, nay, and in case Sir Fitz misunderstood what he said, he picked him up gently and bit off his head, which caused all the peasants much laughter and mirth, it were bad news for barons, but good news for surf. And because Sir Fitz died in test aid, he'd lost them and all. Jack lived happy as Blackpool in the Baron's great hall. Happy ever afterwards, so it is said, with Doris the barmaid and his teddy bear Fred.